What did you guys like from this whole quarantine? Did you pick up more skills, sleep more? Did you eat more? Like, what did you take from all of this? Hey guys, it's your girl Cheska, the one and only. Another video you already know every Sundays and Wednesdays I'm here so make sure that you are here too if you're new to the channel don't forget to subscribe like leave your comments below all my returning subscribers thank you so much for tuning in again and hope everyone is having a great day oh my god so in most states the quarantine is pretty much over lockdown is over states are opening everyone's lit everyone's outside new york is still on lockdown but very very soon in like a week no more lockdown everything is reopening it has literally been a ghost town in new york it has been crazy these lines i'm so over these damn lines at the grocery store the post office i'm just tired of these lines period but during the quarantine uh, i think it's been like since the end of March. On these past couple months, I've learned so much. I've gained some skills because we have nothing but time and opportunity. So it's only right that we use, that I use the time wisely, you know? All right, so I'm gonna go over what I learned, what I gained from this whole lockdown. So first off, I did learn how to do my own manicure, bought the little manicure sets from like the dollar store, did my own manicure. I also invested more in two press-ons. Now, normally I get my nails done. I pay like 45 to $50 just to get my nails done. And I know some girls pay more, but 45 to $50, that's a lot. Especially if I'm going there every like week or two weeks, depending, it's a lot. Because you're getting pedicure too. So now I'm like, you know what? I'm going to invest more into press-ons, get some cute press-ons and probably get my nails done if it's like for a special occasion or like once a month boom also took better care of my skin i did a lot more like masks i did more facials i do want to invest in like a face steamer um my skin is not too bad but i don't know these little bumps but still working on it it's not crazy bad basically took care of my body more not gonna lie i used to take vitamins but they used to make me sleepy so during this whole lockdown i started taking my vitamins every day after i eat vitamin c almonds one a day and also eating grapefruit which i love grapefruit i'm not a fan of oranges too much but i love grapefruit pretty good good for you the lockdown also taught me that i still need to be a germaphobe i was a germaphobe before this and now it just made me more of a germaphobe so it's like now i'm constantly washing my hands constantly wiping things down like everywhere I'm a germaphobic times a thousand now. It's crazy how like, you know, because of the corona, uh, COV-19, COV-19, whatever, COV-19, we still don't know like who has it, where it's coming from. So it's like now it's making me like even more like clean. I guess you said that. Also during this lockdown, I feel like dating got a little bit harder because it's like you can't really See the person face to face or go on a date but i can say that the quarantine has really and not only me but i think in other situations have made people appreciate people for who they are not for their looks because everything was just like you look good let's go out let's meet up and now it's like we can't meet up so it's more like okay am i gonna give this person a chance based on conversation based on their communication based on their consistency and who they are actually and not just for their looks of now it's like i got to weed out the people who are really there for me and really want to be there for me because they really want to get to know me or they just want to be around because they just want to you know do things to you so it was really cool that i did get to weed out um the men that I did not want to date. Just being able to just communicate over the phone or like through FaceTime only really showed me the true colors of a lot of men out there in the dating world. But one of the things I really love the most is that I invested more into my business. Instead of buying more clothes and jewelry and weaves and wigs and all that other superficial stuff, what I did do is I did invest more into 
my business. I invested more into my like YouTube, but my business, my home, stocks instead of like clothes, jewelry. And honestly, it feels good because I know that this is something that I want to do and what I put out is what I will re return. So if I'm giving my all into this, I know I will receive everything that I deserve and more. I'm not gonna lie. I don't know about anybody else, but during this whole lockdown, I've been able to save more money because it's like, it's not like I'm going to like these little dinner dates with my friends like three times a week. I'm not going out on the weekend to the, like any lounges or day parties. And then you know when you go out, us girls, even though we have a closet full of clothes and shoes, we still want to buy more stuff. So it's like, I'm not buying clothes. I'm not really buying shoes. Oh wait, I did buy some shoes. I did buy some clothes, but normally I'd buy like a lot more, but this time it's like, I don't really know what season to dress for or what season to buy for. So it's like, you know what? Let me not even waste my money and buy all these bathing suits. And we don't even really have a summer. You know what I'm saying? Cause even though like states are opening and things are opening doesn't mean that in a couple of weeks like things are gonna be good and you know what's so even great about it is that i was also able to be more consistent with youtube and stay on top of my shit so even though like the lockdown was like on some days it was just like oh i'm so over it i'm like ready to jump off the roof but i just feel like there was good there was bad but Honestly, there was a lot of good uh, during this period. And if you didn't use that time wisely, then... Oh, and I did read more too. I did read more. I did get B. Simone's book I'm like, about manifesting. Love that book. So yeah, like I was saying, like there was more good that came out of this, you know? And I'm sorry that a lot of people had to die during this or a lot of people got sick or had to die, but you know, as far as my case, um, so far, so good. And it's only going up and greater. So what did you guys like, you know, get from this whole quarantine? Did you pick up some more skills? You know, did you accomplish more? Did you sleep more? Did you eat more? Like, what did you take? from all of this as your state reopen have you been going out when new york does reopen i won't be out as much if i am out it will just be around you know like my close peoples or uh some family members and that's pretty much it i'm not really rushing to go to like the clubs or stuff like that like i'm gonna wait to like the time goes by you know to see how everything goes first <laughs> But definitely stay tuned for another video next week. I love you guys. Remain safe. Till next time. Bye.